President William Ruto has directed some ministries to allocate 30% of their vacancies to the National Youth Service servicemen and women. President Ruto said the move is aimed at encouraging and motivating many young Kenyans to join their path to national service and productivity. The head of state said the number of those joining NYS will be doubled during future intakes, adding that the youth play an important role in the development of the country, saying the government will continue to nurture their talents so as to make use of their expertise. We want to double the intake of young people joining the National Youth Service from every location in the Republic of Kenya as a mechanism of creating sufficient patriotism and giving opportunity to young people in rural areas who otherwise may not have the means or may not have the opportunity to be able to explore their talent. The president also asked the Ministry of Water, Sanitation and Irrigation to engage the construction of at least 100 dams and water pumps annually. The president said the move is aimed at enriching education, training and skill development while utilizing the construction plant, machinery and equipment. Meanwhile, President Ruto also lauded plans by the NYS to put 720 acres of land under irrigation to support maize, potato and soybean seed production and multiplication. This spirit of productive learning should extend to the cultivation of 80,000 acres of land under commercial food production. I have already had a conversation with the management of the National Youth Service. We have already agreed that the government of Kenya is going to provide agricultural machinery to support NYS agricultural sector for food production, to enhance self-reliance by NYS, and to support national food production as we seek for food self-reliance as a country. He also said it was encouraging that the service was going to play a significant role in the national tree planting campaign by growing 1 billion trees on 40 acres of land over the next five years. Public Service and Gender Cabinet Secretary Aisha Juma on her part said NYS will continue to empower youth and skills development. The National Youth Service has aligned its programs to contribute to the realization of the Kenya Kwanzaa bottom-up economic transformation agenda in the key five sectors which include agricultural transformation, micro, small and medium enterprise, housing and settlement, healthcare, digital superhighway and creative industry. Nakuru Governor Susan Kihika praised the role played by NYS in the economic transformation of the country. We have seen the level of innovations, we have seen the technical skills that are being taught here. And as a county, Your Excellency, as Nakuru County, I aspire to partner with this institution to help train some of my staff and especially those in enforcement. During the event, 11,692 graduates passed out, with 8,421 being men, 3,271 being service women, and 28 persons living with disability. Samson Jura for Ebro News. <laughs> Ibni ili apate kuyondoa kwa ridi